Most human beings love being in nature. For Dr. Darshan Mehta, every day is another day to discover something new. But you have to pause. As the medical director for the Benson Henry Institute for Mind Body Medicine at Mass General Hospital, he's seen stress cause a long list of problems for patients with anxiety, osteoarthritis, autoimmune disorders, and insomnia. Positive emotions appear to do the opposite. There's a sense of like symmetry. And for a brief moment inside the Arnold Arboretum in Jamaica Plain, that tiny detail transforms this ordinary pine branch into something extraordinary. You know, part of all is like as if you've seen this for the first time. That feeling is now spawning a new area of emotional research. These experts say experiencing awe can have tremendous health benefits, such as calming our nervous system or releasing the love hormone, oxytocin. Sometimes people think about awe, like you have to go out to the mountains or you have to experience a certain thrill in your life. The sense of awe can be cultivated in any environment. Dr. Mehta suggests starting with nature, it right. really is a beautiful day. Though. Right. You so, I know, yeah. It's a blue right. Like, sky. What, so how often do we actually look at right. this color? Like, wow, that's a blue that I don't get to see very often. That pause is important. It allows time for curiosity, then wonder, and finally reflection. And you're connected to something that's bigger than you. Our desire for that feeling is one reason why people travel to the Grand Canyon or want to see the Northern Lights. But Dr. Mehta says experiencing awe doesn't have to be visual and doesn't have to cost money. Different things speak to different people. He suggests listening to music, smelling a flower, or cooking something special. The key is giving yourself time to pause and reflect. I think you notice a shift. When we are connected to something greater than ourselves, you feel like something else is sort of carrying you or something is lifting you. So you feel a sense of lightness, I think, when you're in awe. Yeah, don't you want to just go, oh. Dr. Meta adds, little kids are naturals at this. They always find the awe in most things. So try reimagining your activities through their eyes. It'll make you feel healthier and maybe even younger too. Ed and Maria. That's true.